Hi and welcome. My name is Chowa and we're playing so Secret Government. Let's see a new game The Glorious Revolution or Free Play. Missionless. In 1688, the Glorious Revolution in England culminated in profound reforms after a series of crises. This revolution marked the beginning of the rapid rise of England and its transformation into a powerful war to power. The political and economic power of the country was strengthened, laying a solid foundation for the future formal unity of Great Britain. At the same time, a new tradition was formed that the royal power was limited by the laws established by the Bill's Bill of Rights. The Brotherhood started action in 1685 by placing its stake on a royal king to lead England to the pros prosperous future. English Revolution Brothers, all calculations and prophecies say the days will come that will determine the future of mankind. England is a key point on the map of our time. What will be embodied in it now, over the years, will sprout all over the world. The feudal system has outlived its usefulness, and many in England already see it. It is here and now that our large-scale reforms can be implemented. The new society can assert itself. Roll up your sleeves, brothers. The place is prepared. It's time to lay the foundation. Advice. A country with a minimal of mobilized population will progress extremely quickly if only its government can find a way to maintain public order. Advice. My dear uncle, I'm hurrying back to Europe, hoping to outrun the storm. I've spent many months interpreting the prophecies of Nostradamus. What I read left me shaken. According to scientific minds of our time, everything obeys the laws of nature. The planets move in their orbits, and an apple will always fall down. But the life of humanity is chaotic and uncertain. One need only look at the Europe of recent decades. A powerful English king was executed by his own subjects. The rivalry between Catholic monarchs of the Holy Roman Empire and France brings wars to Protestant countries. The Spanish Empire is growing weaker, while the wetlands of the Netherlands enjoy the bloom in culture and trade. The great Galileo renounced his books. This world is complete chaos for everyone, except us, those who control it. We are the Brotherhood, and we make history. We stand behind the high and mighty of this world, secretly guiding them. We are the global government, formed by the most worthy. We like to say that our work began when the builders of the Temple of Solomon gathered to create the greatest temple of all. This is just legend, but we are indeed builders. Brick by brick, we are building the structure of the future society. We always work in the shadows, and yet Nostradamus foresaw everything. Peering into the future, he described the storms of this and future centuries and the Brotherhood leading humanity forward. He left us clues to solve, and he says, Beware. I'm Beware. coming back to take my place in the Brotherhood. I haven't forgotten what you taught me, and I will join you in the great world of things. But I fear the storm has already come. If it is a secret government, uh, I think that they cannot show their sign, this eye on their flags of their ships. That's too dumb. A place, a place great hope in coming back to England. Unless I was too late. I did it. I founded the first lodge of the Brotherhood in the New World. I was sailing across the ocean, dreaming of how proud I would be to bring this good news to the Grand Master of the Brotherhood, my uncle and mentor. Nevertheless, I foresaw the trouble, as I managed to translate some of the previously obscure prophecies of Nostradamus, by Nostradamus. What waited for me in the port was not triumph, but two messengers full of misfortune. One of them was birdless young man with a feverish gleam in his eyes. The other was 
poor sighted old man. It was the first time I saw the young man, and as far as I recall, the elder had never left the master's residence before. They greeted me sorrowfully and led me through dark alleys to a boat that took us to safety. As the boats weighed on the dark waves, I learned that brotherhood was destroyed. Overnight, the grandmaster and many of his closest associates were accused of religious conspiracy and executed. Only two loyal brothers made it out alive, and I am still alive. I swear our enemies will regret the day they made this mistake. Why are you hiding your face, youth? I thought you would not leave the master's house until you died, old man. I barely had time to go through the initiation, and almost everyone I knew in the Brotherhood had already died. I had better become invisible. Hard work is ahead. If you cannot escape your fear, leave us and get a, and get lost among ordinary people. Otherwise, learn to exploit your weakness. And the second, we always act secretly, but you do not need to hide your face from me. Continue to serve the Brotherhood faithfully, and you will see our terrified enemies run away. You speak about the future of Brotherhood with such confidence, but there are only three of us. The Brotherhood ties are broken, but there is still an undisclosed part of our network in England. We will start by reviewing it and restoring the in its influence. Brotherhood is not about people, but a principle. I have spent years learning to find supporters. The new brothers will be as good as the old ones. Let's go with the first one. We need a new Grandmaster. If you are truly ready for this burden, it is in my power to perform the ritual and make you one. I am the oldest member of the Brotherhood. I was the archivist to the three masters, and I know all the rules. Traditionally, I have to ask you a few questions. That is how we know where you will lead us. I am ready. Ask. Will you condemn the one who starts a war? War is ever loathsome. Agree. Conflict is in human nature. Wars exist, so let them serve us. He will do evil, but sometimes brotherhood values remain unchanged. The value of pacifism is 10. Militarism. Pacifism or militarism? I understand that the great thing is not uh, that prevent wars, but for their purpose, if it's secret government and so, they need it. The value of pacifism is 10. The brotherhood of values remain unchanged. Unchanged. Yeah. It is fair, some people throw away food while others are starving. Anyone who has earned bread with his sweat and mind can decide what to do with it. Animal justice tells us economic equality. To tear each other's throats and human justice tells us to share with our neighbors. And help the weak. Economic equality, economic freedom. He might have given a little to his neighbor, so long as the latter did not beg, while keeping most of it for himself. Let's go with this one. Uh, what do you say about a country that demands sacrifices from its children? The government is more than the individual. Even citizens of the country should contribute to the common cause. Neither a man can be without this country, nor a country without a man, and you will have to find a compromise between your goals. Of course, the government is only a tool in the service of its citizens. Civil liberty. If the individual feels only oppressed, then why does the government exist? Yeah, there is a like this too. So we will 
remain unchanged. I listened to your answers and now I know which society you are striving for. Property must be fairly distributed among people. Is this where you will take us when we call you master? <laughs> I want... Okay, let's begin like this. We will see. You understand me correctly. You will become the grandmaster and revive the brotherhood. We will help you to bring this world closer. So why say brother Isaiah? I will for forget my face, my name and my past. Now the life of the brotherhood is my life. The secrets of the brotherhood are my secrets. The goals of the brotherhood are my future. So on my first night back in England, I accepted the position of Grandmaster. The river and the piercing starlight have witnessed our ritual. Grandmaster, take this nebulous prophecies of Nostradamus and the Brotherhood manuscripts. Your predecessor worked hard on them. They learned from predictions what moments in history will shape the destiny of the world. They describe the principles of the great work of ours. If you can use these principles at the moment foreseen by Nostradamus, you will become the demiurge of the world yet to come. I know that, and unfortunately I also know that what is told in the previously un unencrypted prediction, the Brotherhood will die more than once. To die again, you need to be reborn. I believe that with your help, the Brotherhood will rise like a phoenix from the ashes. But I have to tell you something else. The former master had two hiding places. I never looked into the second, but our enemies knew about it. When I hit, I saw them taking some papers away. There were markings of a rose and a cross on them, and above there was a name. Rosencruz. I saw the same mark on the clasp of a raincoat of one of the thieves. Where do we start, Master? We will start with England. According to the prediction of a great Nostradamus, we are close to the time when events that determine the course of history will take place. But first we will restore broken ties, recruit new supporters and do everything possible to find and punish those who condemned our brothers to death. I know where to start, no? Will you put me on a detail, Brother Isaiah? Thank you for your trust, Grandmaster. Since you left for the New World, the situation in old Europe has changed. There were times when the influence of our Brotherhood spanned across the continent. You are on a global map. It shows what is going on in the world as well as the result of your actions. The map is now in shadow mode. In this mode, it is easier to track the influence of Brotherhood and its enemies. Here you can see everything that's hidden from the eyes of the uninitiated. Uninitiated. You can navigate through the map using the WSD case or by moving the mouse cursor to the edge of the screen. Ooh, really? Uh, isn't that too far? Okay. I'm afraid I'm too old for anything more than a few wise words for the device. So I will have to rely on brother Walter to revive the brotherhood. He is young, but I sense potential in him worthy of a worshipful master. He will make a trusted aid. When you zoom in enough, it, at a certain point the map switches to world mode. It is designed to track the situation in the world and shows what is known to a more or less educated resident of a civilized country. Find Brother Walter on the map, zoom in on him and to the maximum and move the mo mouse cursor over his figure. Oh, shadow mode? Nice. And what about the thing that I can see and other not? Grandmaster, I appear to you. I am ready to solve the curse of the brother Brotherhood. This is the Brothers Selectors. 
it shows the current status of your the direct support. On the brother Wattler is currently under your command. Clicking the left mouse button on the portrait automatically focuses the camera on the specified brother. I have someone in mind who could be very useful to the Brotherhood. He can provide us with a safe place to hide. May I meet him and ask him to join us? Click left mouse button on Brotherhood Boulder. Select to errand type the can that contains errand related to the development of the Brotherhood. Recruit a neon fit. Send Brother Walter to run your errand. Recruit an effort. Assign. I think it's going to take him a few days to run your errand, yet it is dangerous for us to act too openly now. When the Alt key is pressed, the screen displays detailed information about brothers and their errands. Clicking right mouse button on the figure of the brothers will display information about him and the last errands run by him. Okay, I know where we can wait for his return. Not the most secure place, but it will do for a while. Okay. So it's uh, 7th March, 1685. This is the Cryptex. With it, you can control the time in the game. With the space key, you can always pause the game or resume the flow of time. Use the Cryptex to start the time and wait for the errand to be done. The recruit uh, neophyte errand is done. Grandmaster. Come, Grandmaster, my friend has found us a safe place to hide. Appointed appointment of brothers. Development and assignment of brothers. Is the Brotherhood Management window. With it, you will be able to change the current membership of the Brotherhood and the roles performed by the brothers. Let us start the traditional meeting of the Brotherhood members. I'll pay it in a very modest number. According to the Brotherhood Manuscript, all candidates for the Rite of Passage are called Neophytes and are not let inside the circle of initiates during the meeting. They know what the goals and ideas of the Brotherhood are. That is what led them to us. However, they have not yet been initiated, and they are not aware of the specific plans and future steps of the Brotherhood. I used to be a neophyte myself, Grandmaster. On the one hand, knowing of the Brotherhood and almost being a part of it is exhilarating, but on the other, an uninitiated and uninvolved, you are haunted by the thought that you are still not worthy of their trust. Not everyone could take it. Some lost faith in themselves or in the Brotherhood and left for good. I implore you, Grandmaster, do not hesitate in initiating neophytes. If you like a candidate, perform the rite of passage. Let him at least become an accolade, so that he can stand near the circle of initiates and participate in the life of the Brotherhood to the best of his abilities. I urge you not to rush into decisions. Remember that no more than six brothers may be in the circle of initiates other than the master. Each of them receives a title according associated duties and his area of responsibility responsibility. It is the titled brother who can be sent on errands by the Grandmaster. Those who are unworthy of the brother Brotherhood or who can no longer serve its purposes, we can always let go in peace, having bound them by vow of silence, of course. It's time to meet our new brother and find out if he's worthy of the title of one of the initiates. Yeah, do you have a Mjolnir? To 
decide if he is a worthy. Select Nelfit with the left mouse button. Is this him? Nelfit. The area displays this area displays all information about the selected brother. Winston Shorter, 36 years, trades clerk, mentor. Allow me, Grandmaster, to share with you the wisdom of choosing worthy companions. The first thing you should note is the age of the brother. Young people are receptive to new things and learn fast, but they lack the experience and worldly wisdom. Many years of life bring many valuable qualities, but they are unfollowed with weakness and disease. Yeah and some preoccupation. In the world, each brother has a certain social status and profession, as well as a set of special traits and personal qualities. All of this may either benefit the brotherhood or lead to interaction difficulties. Having gained enough experience, each of us changed and moved to a new stage of life. With each such transition, new qualities are acquired. The profession or social status changes. If you have already noticed, Grandmaster, the citizenship of the brothers is critical. Perhaps in the distant future the Brotherhood will erase these fictional borders between countries, but I fear I will not live to see these glorious times. Each brother has a personal opinion on the ideas and objectives on the Brotherhood. Some will carry out the Grandmasters around faithfully and some will question every word. Beware of people with low loyalty. Okay, because they can betray you at the most unexpected moment. But wait, if their loyalty is um, very low, then... It can be expected. And remember that loyalty is hard to earn, but easy to lose. Okay, brother Isaiah, let's go. We are mere mortals imprisoned in fragile bodies, suffering from diseases and wounds. Death can take away your most loyal and experienced brother. And most importantly, every brother must bear the burden of secrecy. People around him may see him as an ordinary merchant, soldier, or craftsman. When exposed, the brother endangers not only himself, but the brotherhood as a whole. Alas, you have already witnessed the sad consequences of neglecting secrecy. From time to time, you should give the brothers a chance to rest, cover their tracks, deflect suspicion from themselves, and restore their secrecy. It's time to make a wise decision on what to do with the Neophyte. Should you want my opinion, Grandmaster, we are not in a position to refuse. We need all the help we can get right now. I know. Move the Neophyte at any empty title slot. You can move over to the title slot to find out what perks it will give to the brother appointed to this title. Perks of the title depend on the level of brother appointed to it. Increase in revenues from lodges with each level of the treasurer. Cost of resources of the events of economy institution minus 4%. Chaplain. Treasurer. Chaplain. Perks of the title depend on the level of the brotherhood appointed to it. Additional experience every decade to all brothers whose level is lower, plus one with each level of the capture plan. Cost of resources on errands of the government institution minus 4%. Secretary and orator. He's a mentor and clerk. Clerk. What? Why in Russian? Uh, it brings you... Uh, 0 0.12? What is it? Uh... Okay, 
so let's place him here. The time will tell if you made the right call. Okay. Close the window to return to the main screen. Thanks. Thank you for your trust. Grandmaster, I share the ideas and goals of the Brotherhood and I am ready to serve our ideals faithfully. As proof of my words, I entrust the Brotherhood with the content, connection and resources available to me. Influence. Yeah, it, there was uh, this perk about influence. 200 influence plus 200 wealth plus 200 power. Where is it? Influence, wealth, power. Next. Your help is very timely, my new friend, but I fear this is not enough and the problem of lack of resources still needs to be addressed. This area displays the resources available to the Brotherhood. These resources are spent by the brothers running your errands. Let's see what we can achieve in this country. So, you here. Each country has its own development level of state, institutions such as government, economic and military institutions. The development level depends on many in internal parameters. For us it is important because the higher its value, the more resources we can gain for the Brotherhood by infiltrating this institution. We are lucky that England is currently the world leader in many areas. Grandmaster, I happen to know a beautiful young lady whose father is powerful to me. Is this guy? Worshipful master treasurer. Um, young lady whose father is powerful main in the treasury. I'm sure we can arrange a rendezvous with him. Good idea, brother Walter. Your talents please the old man. Let's take advantage of this opportunity. Uh, it's you. Country institutions, infiltrate economic institution. This is the errand's window. Here you can learn the details of the errand you are going to have your brother too. To complete the errand, the brothers will need to arrange meetings with the right people, use some connections, spend a lot of money, or even resort to the services of every to very dark individuals. All these expenses can be presented represented as a cost of the errand, in resources of influence, wealth, and power. Any activity somehow attracts attention, both to the individual brother and to the brotherhood as a whole. Do not forget that it takes some time to complete a worthwhile task, everything comes to the one who knows how to wait. Additional resources are required to complete the event. At the bottom of each resource its costs are displayed, at the top the amount that will be obtained after the event is done. Running an errand consumes the secrecy of the brother assigned to it. Exhausting the secrecy will result the brothers in the brother's exposure, of course, and thereby he will have to abort the errand. The resources spent on the errand will not be returned in that case. Moreover, the brother will become an easy target for the detra detractors until he covers his tracks and restores his secrecy. In, if the Brotherhood operates on the territory of a certain country, it attracts attention from its rulers. Such attention is represented as awareness. Rulers don't like it when someone tries to run their state without their knowledge. Moreover, any country can easily destroy the Brotherhood in direct confrontation. And of course, running an errand takes time. It is measured in days. All these days our brothers will be busy with this with the errand. You may also want to pay attention to the forecast of consequences and possible factors that make it difficult to complete the errand or even impossible to complete it at all. The lo level of infiltration into the institution in economy will increase to one. 
Awareness grows by 644. The higher the current level of infiltration and power of the institution, the more difficult and expensive it is to expand the influence of the Brotherhood in it. If the if there are several brothers in the same country who can take on an errand, you can change the executing agent for this errand using the brother, brother selector. Please know that when the executing agent changes, the cost of the errand also changes. Being a worshipful master, Brother Walter can infiltrate the institution at a lower cost of resources thanks to the perks of his title. I can see it. Ooh, nine. Yep. We could send Brother Walter to or our new friend on the server. The choice is yours, Grandmaster. Send me, Grandmaster. Please, I will not let you down. Need I say more? A sign. We're not in a position to let our brothers sit around doing nothing. I suggest keeping them both occupied. There are no point in sending two brothers on the same errand due to secrecy. They are likely in to hinder each other. Send a free brother on an errand of infiltrate the government institution. Minus 11. Ooh. By right clicking on the errand icon, you automatically confirm it by passing. Okay, now that the both of brothers are running errands, all we can do is wait for their return and monitor their progress. By the way, I found a good stock of excellent whiskey in the cellars of the shelter that our new friend granted us. Would you like some? Of course! Bring it! Let's see. 5 days, 4 days, 3, 2, 1, go. We did it, Grandmaster. We now have valuable connection and acquaintances in two of the three main institutions in England. I suggest we don't rest on our laurel and make our way to the remaining institution. I just happened to meet the niece of a distinguished general. By the way, do you know where brother Isaiah is? I haven't seen him today. Yeah, where is he? Okay. Nothing in here. So we begin with England, right? It's cool. So it's... Yeah, I like it. So we begin from easy one. Send one of the brothers to infiltrate the military institution. Yeah, send him. Assign. I am sorry, Grandmaster, but it is taking me longer and longer to get there. Age, you see, what did I miss? I think it's time to make use of the fruits of our labors and get some resources for the Brotherhood's treasury. We have a few connections in the England English Economic Institution. Let us turn to them and increase our wealth. Select an urban exploit. Economic Institution Exploration. Unlike before, here we can tell the brother how much time he can allocate for this error. The more time he spends on it, the more resources he can bring to the Brotherhood's treasury, but he will lose secrecy and attract attention from the local authorities, increasing awareness. Okay. The Brotherhood will gain 7 of the resource wealth. 17. In the current situation, I will have a brother exploit this institution for 7 days. 20! That's a lot. A sign. Our brothers are off to the, do good deeds again. Ah, so we can afford getting a good night's sleep and gain strength. This brother Isaiah is a little bit 
Grandmaster, I have distribu- disturbing thoughts. Let's take a closer look at the situation in England. That's what I thought. Just look at the situation with awareness and public order. Public order. 100. Public order reflects the overall level of government control over the situation in the country. The lower it is, the worse for the country, but the easier it is for our brothers to act and not so. Now, order in England is quite high. Awareness shows how much attention from local authorities we have drawn by our actions. If there is too much of it, the recent unfortunate events may be repeated. And we have already attracted too much attention. Our supporters in the country's institutions are not enough to cover us yet. If we don't get, do something now, this could all end badly. It is not profitable to stop infiltrating the military institution now. All located resources will be lost in vain. While the exploration of the economic industry can be interrupted without much loss. Hurry, Grandmaster, call your brother of his errand. I hope I've been spared trouble. Forgive me, Grandmaster, I was careless. Wait until the errand is done, resume time on cryptics to do this. Okay, the infiltrate military institution Iran is done, Grandmaster. It was a success, Grandmaster. We we now have access to all three institutions in England, which means we can get all the necessary resources for the Brotherhood when we need them. But don't overdo it and watch the level of awareness. I took the liberty of sketching out a plan for an early revival of the Brotherhood. Take a look, will you? This is the objective window. Ooh, finally. It contains information about all the major and minor objectives of the Brotherhood. For your convenience, objectives are grouped by time. You can select the objective of interest from this menu. Revival of the Brotherhood. No, everything or stay in the dark. The Brotherhood can make their voices heard in a particular country choosing it for the Brotherhood interest and a deep infiltration of its members. However, greatest awareness can lead to negative consequences. In contrast, the Brotherhood can be a mystery to society and can carefully mine resources without attracting dangerous attention. You can see the context of the objective. This uh, area displays the steps that are required to fulfill the objective. There is also an award that the Brotherhood will earn if the objective is reached. Note that the first step of the current objective is already marked as a completed. We have achieved a lot, but we are still few when we do not have our own lodge. We have infiltrated English institution deeply enough to set up a lodge there, but doing so now is too risky. We need time to do our job and clear out people's short memories of us. Let their minds be filled with new everyday problems. Can I go to France? I know French and I've always wanted to go there. Walter. Yes, it might be time to look for allies there, or in any other country. It's up for, to the Grandmasters to decide. Choose close the objective window. You can also do this by pressing escape button key. Recruit two neophytes and grant them titles. Establish a lodge in England. Too early. Okay, I have only one. Please, Grandmaster, send me to France. They say it's a country of wonderful girl opportunities. Send Brother Walder into Erin. What's this? Move the brother. France. The brother Winston Shorter moves. Walter Wilson moves to France.
sent brother Walter on the errand, moved to France. Okay, sign. Uh, you can do this by selecting this errand in the Brotherhood section, or simply drag the brother figure from England to France. Ah! Okay. Thank you, Grandmaster. I'll send you a word as soon as I get to Paris. France. Okay, treasure. He, what he can do? He cannot do this? Okay, uh, we are very aware here. Nothing here. Nothing here. Okay, let's just wait. It can go down, right? 28, yes. Let's see. Uh, we need the time. England. What do we need? Oh, they talking. Well, I wouldn't mind to uh, Brother Winston trip either Denmark perhaps or the Netherlands. Anyway, I'm ready for any task. Wait until both brothers finish their journey. Send him to Denmark. A sign sixteen. It's not so far. Go. Fast mode. They can restore their secrecy. That's actually very good. Okay, the move the Brotherhood. Assign Brother Walter to infiltrate any of country's institution. Walter. What is his name? Winston. Walter is this guy. Um, infiltrate. Grandmaster, there have been some complications. Uh, my command of the language is not good enough. The French are Catholics and see me as an outsider from a Protestant country. It is difficult for me to gain their trust. It will require too much effort and resources. It would be wise to find associates in this country and have them to run the errands instead. Close the errand. Finally. Recruit a neophyte. France. What? That much? Send brother Walter to recruit an effort in France. Great master, I think you and Walter have already the ropes and now you can handle this without me grumbling over your ear. Find us two more suitable brothers while I let my old bones rest. Recruit two neophytes and grant them titles, preferably with non-English citizenship. Nope. Recruit neophyte. 55, that's a lot actually. Okay, let's wait. Two, one, go. Okay, it's done. Appointment of brothers. Let's see who we have here. 
What? What's this? It's a uh, French? I don't like this guy. He has no loyalty. This guy is okay. Uh, trader. He give you one wealth. Uh, 0 0.1 wealth. Every day. Uh, in countries, uh, you have... Uh, trading treaty. With his uh, main country. He make it with... Uh, less um, resource uses. Uh, chance. Oh, chance of interrogation is higher with this guy by twenty five percent. Now, when you're trying to find some clues or investigate. Or keep eye, an eye on someone. He uses two times less resources and conspiracy. Okay, they need to change it. Uh, Kaplan, Chaplain, Secretary, Raider, Targeter Bloodhound. He's more like uh, this guy. Tyler. Perks of the title depend on the level of brotherhood appointed to it. Increase the secrecy of all brothers uh, on the time of situation attempts. Military institution. Go there. I don't like this guy. At all. Clerk. Level 2. Brainiac. Ooh. Mentor. Clerk. Okay, he's a clerk. Secretary. Okay, he will be a secretary for now. I don't like him, I know. So, recruit two neophytes and grant them titles, preferably with non-English citizenship. Carefully monitor resources, infiltrate the institutions of countries and exploit them. At this stage, your most important resources will be wealth and influence. Influence. At this stage. Okay, so we need it right now. So... Economic institution. 50, 20. Ooh, that's a lot. That's a lot. And 10. That's... Okay. Sign. This guy cannot make anything here. Who is this? Tyler Okay, Tyler, this guy Infiltrate this one Ooh, he's good here So I think that this guy must go back Country institution Or wait Too much, too much. Ooh, that's a lot. Nope. Go back to England. Oh, too expensive. Okay, you will wait. Just wait. Okay, wait. 
Very well, Grandmaster, the Brotherhood is expanding, and it's time for us to leave our dilapidated shelter and establish a more dignified home for ourselves. Move Brother Walter back to England to send him on this errand. I don't have enough money. I think... What's this? Hide signs of activity? Hide from the world. Ooh, really? England. England. Too many. Money. And two. Tyler. And this guy here. Wait, he was infiltrated, what? His last action? Treasurer, no, this guy. Economic institution, right? So he can go infiltrate economic, economic institution exploration. Spend five days, sign. This guy? Uh, no, not this guy, this guy, Tyler. He infiltrate governance institution, so take this one. Whoa! Like this. The sign. Wait. Three days, two days. Pause. Denmark and France entered in a trade agreement. The government of Denmark shifted their focus to the to other issues. Bring Brother Walter back to England. Okay, so we will continue next time. That's all for today. Oh, huh, interesting. It's already I don't need to save it. That's all for today. I hope you enjoy it. Smash like if you did, leave your comments and subscribe. See you in the next videos. Bye!